here, and we just appreciate you all being here. Um, I want to especially thank those of you from Arkansas that I got to visit with a little earlier. Where are you guys at? Wave your hand. There we are. I apologize for being late. One thing I'd like to say before I ask a, just a question or two, but don't ever underestimate the value of you being here. Uh, those of us on the committee asked to be on the committee. My dad did 20 years in the Air Force, and I really do understand how important these things are, but your, your, your team here does a tremendous job representing you. And like you say, they do outstanding, but there's no substitute for you being up here, looking at your members of Congress in the eye and saying, John, you know, this is really, really, really very important. So I applaud you. This is a tough trip. It's an expensive trip. But again, I, I appreciate you being here because that helps us push uh, these things that are so important forward. I also want to thank the, uh, while I'm thanking people, the, the auxiliary. And uh, we know who does. I've got a wife and three daughters. We know who actually does the work. And we do appreciate your efforts. Uh, you've heard me tell in the past that I was with a group and uh, said that the auxiliary was the backbone of the, the organization, which you all are. Uh, my wife on the way home said, John, they're also the brains of the organization. <laughs> so I think there's a lot of truth to that also. Let me just ask a, 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 a question, Commander, real quick. It's my understanding that DAV has had a staff member detail the VA as part of their team that is developing VBMS. Based on reports of the staff member, do you believe VBMS is on track to improve the claims process? And what changes should VA make to ensure proper implementation. Also, do you share my concern about the need for a long-term plan to scan claims-related documents? Thank you for the question, uh, Senator Bozeman. Uh, we believe EBA is uh, definitely on the right track uh, with the Veterans Benefits Management System, or, or VBMS, uh, and we look forward to its deployment beginning in July. Uh, all signs indicate that uh, All signs indicate that uh, this system has the potential to revolutionize uh, the way that VA uh, does its claims work, and it will help to greatly improve the efficiency and the accuracy of uh, uh, the VA claims process. Uh, and you're right, we do and have had for some time a staff member uh, uh, helping uh, the, the VBA folks on the team. And uh, we're absolutely pleased to have been consulted and to be able to provide that meaningful input. Uh, that's ongoing. Uh, we plan to continue doing that. Um, but we will certainly uh, watch this process very closely uh, and monitor uh, as they wrap things up here or get to the uh, deployment. And uh, we will certainly ensure that, from our perspective, the end product is as advertised. So you've been really, the, the, the staff member being there has been a really positive thing then? Uh, absolutely. Uh, uh, specifically, the, the Assistant National Service Director, Jim Marsalek, uh, one of our professional staff members, uh, his input has been uh, invaluable to the VA folks. Yeah. They've told us as much. Uh, and uh, certainly some uh, changes uh, and tweaks have been made here and there based on our input and the input of other VSOs. Uh, but again, we're going to continue to uh, watch it very closely. Uh, we expect probably some bumps in the road, but we are uh, very much uh, behind uh, the VBMS project. Good. Well, I'm glad to hear that. I'd, I'd heard, you know, that things were going well in that regard. It's good to hear that officially. And uh, I think these are the kind of uh, you know, again, uh, people working up here, you guys working so hard, these are the kind of, uh, you know, relationships that we need to have. And, uh, you know, nobody understands this better than you, than you, you know, in the sense of being uh, the recipients. And uh, like I say, this is the kind of collaboration that we need to, to, to further things. So it's a great example, and uh, we appreciate it. So thank you, Madam Chair. Thank you very much, Senator. Um, 